my name is Amy Ecker and welcome to my channel. Today I'm doing the unboxing of BoxyCharm for September. I was so bummed, so like, well bummed for me but not for my friend. So my friend was a new subscriber to BoxyCharm and got her box like a week and a half before I got mine. Hello, I've been loyal. What's up with that? Um, so I'm, I was absolutely jealous that a new client got her box over someone that has been buying this for a while. They're such brats. But anyways, this one is called a boxy baddie. So let's, what's in this month's subscription? So this subscription runs about $20, $22, somewhere in there. And your first item comes with the Soiree Diaries eyeshadow palette. Woo! Okay, so it retails for $34 from Pure Cosmetics. It's in a um, cardboard type container that kind of is made into looking like marble. Totally cute there. But it has wonderful fall neutral colors. Uh, some warm, some cool. I actually used... Um, Basically this one up here, which is called Private Party. I use some Splurge, Gala, Snazzy, and Dazzle. Um, so that's basically the colors that I have on my eye today. And you're gonna get a chance to see how I use these colors to create this eye look in a minute. Then eyebrows. I had never used a MAC Cosmetic Eyebrow Pencil and this retails for $18. This um, is a self-propelling, self-sharpening, and brow defining. I will say it does define the brows. So when I, when I first opened this up, it was so teeny tiny, look how, it's so cute. It's just like a little baby of an eyeliner. But when I started using it, I kind of flicked in between the hairs and I liked how this gave a nice hair-like look versus that colored in type eyebrow that looks like you've stenciled it. Um, so that is really, really nice. And then we got an ultra satin lip, which is on my lip today. Mm. It's from ColourPop. It's a high pigma pigmation. Pigmation. Is that related to oink nation? I don't know. A high pigmentation and satin matte finish in liquid lipstick. Uh, a liquid lipstick form to keep your lips soft and comfy all day long. I do like ColourPop, so this will be nice to just throw in my purse today and update my lips as I need to. Then we got a HD powder, and this is a finishing powder. It's by Studio Makeup. I never tried that, so that's fun to try. It was $35, it's lightweight, HD powder sets makeup with a flawless finish and suitable for all skin types. Um, I, it did go on really nice, it is super finely milled, so even though it's got little holes in the container, you don't really need to shake it much and you're going to have a lot of product up on top of the uh, tray that is on the inside, and let me tell you, I accidentally shook a little too hard and I had a lot of product to play with. Then lastly, not lastly, kind of second to lastly, we got these two brushes which I use today. Um, I use this to pack on some of the shine and I use this as my under eye liner brush. So for these two, that's $20. Now last but not least. Briogeo put in Don't Despair Repair a Deep Conditioning Mask. Ooh. So um, I do look forward to using that the next time I shampoo my hair. And that says to leave on for five to 10 minutes before rinsing. If you want even a deeper conditioning treatment to your hair, go ahead and put it on for 30 minutes, put your cap on and let it kind of heat underneath your cap. So once again, BoxyCharm did a phenomenal job other than they made me jealous that my friend that just um, subscribed basically got her box before me. And that hurt my feeling. I have one feeling and it jumped all over it. So BoxyCharm, I've gotten you at least two subscriptions in the last 60 days and hello. All right, I'll get off my little high horse. But let's go back to the pure soiree diet. Um, the 
Soiree Diaries, okay, I loved the combo. So the combo meaning that it's got good pigmentation, maybe it's a trifecta, good <laughs> pigmentation, they blended well and didn't have a lot of fallout. I mean, who doesn't like those three? So I have to say Pure Cosmetics did a fantastic job on this palette and I am super excited about what they did with this. So anyways, thank you Pure Cosmetics for um, teaming up with BoxyCharm because I really, really like this palette. So I can see this one being kind of staying on my station here so that I can pick it up because it's just got a lot of great nude colors and again because they blend well and there's not a lot of fallout that one will be nice to just be able to pick up if i need to ground any colors as i'm playing so just a really great month in september from boxycharm and boxycharm i totally appreciate it thank you so much okay we're going to start with the setting powder from studio makeup got an eye pencil from mac called lingering Ooh, sounds so pretty. Twist that up a little bit. It's a nice dark brown color. What I like about this pencil is it's tiny, which gives you an opportunity to make it look more like hair, unless like you penciled it in a stencil. Then we've got two new brushes, so these will be fun to try today. We've got an angled liner. Let's just get these out of the package. So we have an angled liner. I sometimes use these angled liners for eyebrows also. And then we have a flat shader. So that's gonna be fun to use today. I'm gonna to be using my Catrice Ultimate Stay Lip Liner. And then we're gonna add the color, boop! We're gonna add the color Strut from ColourPop. They also included some Rugio Don't Despair Repair Deep Conditioning Mask, so that'll be good to try the next time I wash my hair. Now we're gonna use the Pure Soiree Diaries palette. Um, these do not have, oh no, I lied. I was gonna say these don't have any names, but my eyes cannot see this early in the morning. They actually do have names, and look how pretty this palette is. And it's got a mirror, Woo! but this palette is really pretty for nudes. Get all nudey together. And we will start with Private Party. We're gonna move up to the color Gala. I'm gonna come up here to the color Splurge. Next, we're going to pick up the color Snazzy. I like the color Snazzy. It's like a brown with some purple undertones. It's kind of a fun brown. I will say it's more unique than I've seen in all the nude palettes recently. Hmm. Okay, this palette is blending super well and doesn't have a lot of fallout. Who doesn't like an eyeshadow that blends well and then doesn't have a lot of fallout? Okay, I know this says it's a flat shader brush, but we're gonna use this color with some Dazzle to go with our Snazzy. Okay, I'm gonna pick up on my angled liner, I'm gonna pick up some more of that dazzle, and I'm gonna go in my inner quarter of the eye with my new Bodyography Pro angled brush. And then I'm gonna pick up Snazzy and use that. Underneath. Thank you so much for watching this video unboxing tutorial using BoxyCharm. This is definitely one of my faves because it always has some great products that are full sizes. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. 
If you haven't subscribed, please consider subscribing or refer me to a friend. And as always, you have a choice, so make it a great one. Until next time.